Hello people, welcome back. This is Nakul, back with the gaming video of Lava Iris Fuel 50 as many of you guys were requesting for it. So here's the video guys. Plus now I'm gonna be turning off the light of my room so you guys can see the gameplay better. So let's get started. So before I start playing all the games and show you the gameplay, let me show you what is the CPU temperature right now. So let's go over here. And as you can see, the current CPU temperature is around 36 degrees Celsius and battery temperature is 26 degrees Celsius. And the battery is 87%. So let's start playing the games now. The first one is the Badland. It's a great game, not that heavy, but still uh, heavier than the usual games. So let's see this. So all you have to do in this game is fly this birdie thing to the next level, fly it forward by tapping your finger on the screen, as you can see. And I must say it's really hard to play looking at the camera. Let's see. And these two are my clones. No, obviously I'm not so good at this game. And if you notice, I've already lost my two clones. And now I have four. Lost one more. Okay, lost another one. So this game is not that easy, I would say. But still, no lag. The game is running smooth. The graphics are nice. Okay. And as much, here we go. So I was saying, and as much as clones you take to the next level, the more points you get. And I was only able to make three of them. And here we go, the speed boost. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. died anyways that's about it about this game let's play the asphalt 8 now so let me show you the gameplay of this game So let's go and play this game. Next, the race. Though it's gonna be really difficult to look in the camera and play this game. Okay, guys. So now I have to mute the sound of this game, else YouTube won't let me upload this video because of the song. As you guys can see there are like no lags at all whatsoever the game is running all fine oopsie so obviously I'm not so good at playing this game but anyways I'm just playing to show you guys the gameplay and that it runs all smooth. No lag or nothing at all. Okay, that was cool.
so apparently despite so despite being so bad at this game i'm still coming first as you can see <laughs> this is great but we are talking about the game players so they are like no lag the game is pretty smooth no glitches nothing at all no flicker oops oh that was awful go 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 and i'm coming second no ah oh. There's the finish line. Anyways, I came second, but as you guys just saw, the game ran pretty smoothly. So let's go to home and jump into the next game. Let me clear all this. So the next game is which all you guys love it, Modern Combat Five. So let's run this game. So here we go guys, Modern Combat 5. So, Confirm extraction location. Over. Uh, hold up. Come on. So I was saying that there are no Let's lags go. at Thanks. all right now. The game is running pretty smoothly. Though the graphics are not so great because of the screen resolution. There are some pixelation I can see here and there. But pretty smooth. Also, I guess it's down to have a great shot.
So as you can see the graphics are great guys. No lag at all. Running pretty smoothly. There we go guys, this right the chopper. And like no lags at all. So the game ran pretty smooth. Play as a guest. Okay. Listen to me Rue, Venice did not go down like that. Gilman is... Trying to erase their involvement. You can see some pixelization over here. They planned it all. You can see these squares a bit. So this is what I was talking about, the pixelization because of the screen resolution. Because it's not even semi HD. But the game is running pretty smoothly. Anyways, let's move on. And let's run the last game, which is the Dead Trigger 2. So it says blow off arms and legs of zombies to earn more money. Here I come. What the hell is this? So as you guys just saw that was the gameplay of Dead Trigger 2 and it was pretty smooth, no lags at all. In fact all of these games ran pretty smooth, no lags, no jittering or glitches at all. So the performance of this phone is pretty great in gaming also. So now let's see what is the temperature of the CPU and battery. Okay, so the CPU temperature is 46 degrees Celsius and battery temperature is 32 degrees Celsius. And I was on 87 when I started playing and now the battery remaining is 81%. So that's pretty cool. So I was playing these games for about half an hour I guess. So that's pretty cool that only 6% of battery uh, dropped and not much more. And all those crappy parts gonna get edited in this video and you're gonna see the 
gameplay only. So I was playing for about half an hour all these games and the temperature went up to 10 degrees and the battery drain was only 6%. So pretty great performance by this phone. So all games play well. So pretty great so pretty so pretty great performance by this phone. All gameplay was pretty so pretty great performance by this phone. So pretty great performance by this phone. All games were very smooth and playable, nothing glitchy or laggy. So that's pretty much about it for now guys. This was a gaming video of new Lava Iris Fuel 50. If you have any questions, comments, then put them in the comments down below. Plus I have also made a Facebook page for people who want to know about my current and upcoming activities. So you can go and like me there. If you want to ask me some questions or want to take some advice, so you can directly ask me over there and I'll be able to reply you more easily. So the link of that page will be in the description below. So go and like me there. And make sure you give this video a thumbs up and share if you like my videos. So thank you for watching guys and subscribe for more videos.